Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Mokalever, and thank you for joining me here. So, let's continue playing as the Steel Rangers. Um, this might be the last video in the series, I'm not sure. Obviously, we'll know by the end, but let's get started anyway. So, right now, last time we took out Kaisar's Legion, with a lot of help from the rest of the Brotherhood of Steel Alliance. And now, because of what happened, there's a lot of independent nations, which will, as you will see, very quickly get attacked by the Western Brotherhood. Let's watch it. Also, by the way, I am justifying on the Washington Brotherhood, so I can go to war with them. But, let's see, we have 25 days until we can go there. The Western Brotherhood declared war on cowboy countries, which is down here. Because apparently the Brotherhood has some sort of claim on them. Because I gave them that territory once the war was over. So, really, my goal is to take out the Washington Brotherhood. They're big, they're large, and I want to see what my focuses can do when we're at war with them with slaying the giants and then standing tall. Now, before we go to war with them, I feel that I could probably use some sort of power armor because, well, I mean, why wouldn't I need, or I need, well, I have power armor. I need anti-tank. That is what I mean. And as you can tell, I've already redirected my armies to form certain specific uh, field army groups, we'll say. Cool. Let my puppets come in the war that I'm not actually going to fight at all, and I don't even have ships, so really, no point for me to do anything about that. But I will need a lot of anti-tank and piercing for those booboos. So, we're going to keep letting time go on. We're, we will definitely need more manpower, so I'm going to do this as a precaution. I don't need nearly as many divisions as I do did before, so I'm going to cut those down a little bit. Uh, for this, cut that down by one. And also, I was joined here by my cat named Mocha, but now apparently he wants to leave. Right, Mok Mok? You really enjoyed spending time in my room. There you go, Mok. Bye-bye, Mok Mok. Alright, my apologies. Mocha likes to sleep in rooms that are very, very quiet. And, uh, when I'm talking, I guess he doesn't like me talking. Oh, well. So, we're getting our divisions up here. I'm not going to go to war yet because I want to wait first until we get some anti-tank. I should have researched that a long time ago, but whatever. So, like usual, I want to try to bait my enemies into attacking me. So that we can feel really good about ourselves when they lose a lot of their manpower because, well... Sometimes you just got to exploit that Hoi 4 AI and have a great time doing so. So we'll do that. I won't call on my allies to begin with because I want to see if I can do anything without them first. So you guys come down here. Do that. We got some better uh, dive bombers. Love it. And let's go ahead and get some anti-tank. Because that will be very important to do and make. Cool. I'm going to give it a little bit more time. I mean, the Brotherhood is going to continue declaring war on its former territories. I don't really care. So, there's that. More defense, more breakthrough. This actually will be important because when, as we're attacking like crazy. Hmm, we need more stuff here. Um, just, I want as much piercing as possible. I probably won't ever get enough piercing. So, but the more piercing the better. Another couple of divisions. Cool. Throw you on to here, but really just... Throw you over here. Um, really doesn't. It really doesn't matter. Common energy weapons, nice. Wait, common energy. How'd I do common energy weaponry? What? Um, I guess I just researched this. Um, and we already had advanced energy weaponry. Did the Brotherhood give that to me? Maybe they did give that to me, huh? Trouble on the home front. Citadel of Steel. Uh, alloy construction. Navarro tactical data. Renovate arms factories. Oh, scribe lexicon. Alright, so I want them to do this. Lasers for men. The hammer. Stuff like that. Ooh, yeah, give me that. I want more breakthrough. And steel. Ooh, baby, that looks pretty good. Nice, cool. Got a few more divisions, or I guess one more division doesn't really matter. But yeah, just want to bait the enemies into attacking me as best as I can. Let's go ahead and start... Uh, how much long do we have? 39 days? When we have 20 days left for anti-tank, I will go ahead and start justifying again, because I do need a little bit more time for me to create anti-tank rifles. So, 
We don't have a lot of war support, which kind of sucks. Let's see, focus on the internal sphere. We did 20 days yet. We're getting close. And let's go ahead and justify on them again. Actually, what if I did it on this group? Oh, that's much shorter than 200 days. 125 versus 215. Much shorter. So let's see. I need more stability. First of all, stability minus war support. Um... Really? Hmm. I need more war support, actually. Let's do that, and we'll do that as well at the same time. Cool. We're almost done with anti-tank. That'd be great. And I will need more manpower. This 2,000 sum will not be enough. Even though we are still technically mobilizing more and more men. Cool. Want to bait Port Monto attacking us like crazy, as well as the Brotherhood, but we'll see what happens. Nice. Anti-tank. Get some more piercing. Over here... I'm going to do the same type of deal. I want them to try to attack me. We've got the anti-tank. Now we've got to produce a lot of anti-tank. And we're not producing any of this, which is a little bit of a concern. So we're going to do this by doing that to that to that to that to that. So we're still producing guns. Lower this by three. Increase this by five. And we should be okay at least for now. Don't need to even see that. Don't need to see this either. Um, everything else seems to be pretty much okay. Withered Dog Squid, Worn Iron Alliances, and let's see how the war is going down here. So, the Brotherhood of Steel, we've now added the Baudelio Ranchers. Long range radio, cool. Let's get some decryption, that could help us out quite a bit. As we're slowly getting more war support. It's construction engineering, very nice. Keep an eye on this stuff. Uh, my allies need to make sure that they have more and more stuff. So let's do that for the Sky Reavers. Let time go on. And there goes the Western Brotherhood of Steel declaring war on the Phoenix Republic, eh? Sac City. Well, we'll keep building up stuff for the NCR because now we can lower the autonomy of this puppet. Do that. Help them out in their wars. Sure, whatever. I really don't care. And go ahead and add on this anti tank support. So we get more piercing, elite rangers. Combat width isn't as what I would like it to be, but whatever. And thank god we got a lot of XP. Army XP to be cracked here. Nice. Very nice. And look at all that manpower that went down. Cool. Well, we'll definitely see what happens here. Um, They want to fight those enemies down there. Yeah, I really don't care. I mean, really uninterested in fighting down there. I just want to take out the Brotherhood, so. The Washington Brotherhood, to be specific. Uh, I could... I'd probably throw the Power Armor here, too, because they don't really help with piercing too much. Yeah, they got a little bit. These are Brotherhood Paladins, but their piercing isn't great. As we're trying to throw on as much piercing as possible on other divisions. Let's do that. Let's get a little bit more encryption. Very cool. And also, we have a lot of war goals against all these places that basically rebelled against us after the war was over. Ooh, more piercing. Heck yeah. But I'm not really interested in taking this territory out. We took them out once. It just doesn't interest me at the current moment. Now in the next playthrough, the next campaign I do, oh, it'll be, interest me very, very much. And eh, just do that. Who cares? Throw you on here. Whatever. But, yeah. Actually, throw the infantry this way so I don't use as much army XP for my infantry. Alright. A few more divisions. Oh, the NCR actually has an APC. Well, very little armor, or very little hardness, I should say. 7% hardness. Armor is 1.7, so they're going to get pierced in almost immediately. Which kind of sucks, but whatever. Uh, for you guys, I'm going to back you up into the feeding grounds just because I'm not sure where else to put you. Get another field, another general. Nice, unpredictable attacks. Let's get salvage launcher next. How many more days until we can go to war with these guys? Oh, a couple more days, not bad. And the deficit of our anti tank isn't doing bad if we can make 13 things of anti tank a day. That actually isn't too bad. Because at max with the anti tank currently, we'll get 33.7 piercing now that still 
might not be enough for us to pierce the enemy's divisions, but we'll definitely see. Definitely, definitely, definitely see. All right, construction engineering, very nice. Just letting time go on as we're watching the Brotherhood slowly, 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 try to take out the former Khazar's Legion land. Okay, the war goal, still not there. That's fine, no worries. Uh, war support isn't really helping us. Oh, we're not really getting any more war support. All right, then. Yeah. All right, now we can go to war with Crowlands. We had to justify a war on them by December 12th, which is fine because I'm looking at the deficit right now of anti-tank. And probably by the end of November, we will be close to ending our deficit. And I want to make sure that everything at least has a little bit of anti-tank. Cool. Oh, we could actually probably use an airbase up here too. Give me three of those right now. Uh, or make it three. Cool. More divisions. Awesome. This is going to be a little bit more concerning. Just help them build stuff in the NCR down there. Very good. Oh, we got a militia unit by the NCR. With power armor? Why would you do that? Why would you lower your power armor armor statistic with anti-tank? Oh, two sons. Um, yeah, just give it to the Brotherhood. Because they're the ones who declared war on them. And I really don't care about this. Cool. Good job, guys. Deficit. Looking very nice. We have until December 12th. 12th. Oh, yes. Even better anti-tank. Just give me as much piercing as humanly possible. Cool. White Legs has joined us as an ally. December 12th. Calling the Sky Reavers. Nah, I don't need, really need to. Deficit is getting lower. I mean, I did maybe should not have upgraded to the anti-tank, but when we have everything there, we have 41.2 piercing. That's pretty good. But anyways, the show must go on. Let's see what happens. I'm not going to call my allies first. I want to see what happens when they go to war with me straight up first. I'm not going to call anyone in, including my own puppets. Oh, are we losing in a few locations, perhaps? No? Maybe? Ah, baiting that AI has never been better. I don't want to call in even my puppets because my puppets will call in all these other allies, and I want to see what I can do by myself first, at least baiting in the enemies. And right now, they're not really getting baited. So, go and come down here. Really still want to bait them. No? Nothing? Cool. Take half of you guys, then. Just keep increasing this. And we will take another one division from here to do that. Do that. Usually, I don't like to bait stuff, but, I mean, this is just... Understandably, relatively easy to do. Take me, give me one of these guys as well. Ooh, last night. Oh, infantry expert. Yes, please. Any movement yet? Nope. Give me one of you. That's fine if he comes over here. I really don't care. Uh, give me you two as well. That should help out at least a little bit. Give me half of you guys. Because they. Because the AI has to think that they actually have to attack into mountains, and that really hurts people. Nice, overcharged ammunition. Honestly, if this doesn't work, I'm probably just going to end up attacking a lot anyways, so no worries. Um, Take the motorized out of there. Ooh, we got enough manpower. No, they're still not attacking. I did this a little earlier. tried a little earlier. Give me half. Uh, no. Give me you three. Oops, well, crap, I didn't mean to do that. Well, whatever, I'm just going ahead and try to attack. They, they're they not taking the bait. Cool. Alright, so you guys come up here. Don't, don't do this. Like, seriously, what the heck. You might as well throw you on here as well. We're going to strike hard on the left. Weep. Bop, 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 bop. Oh, alright, I'm actually taking the bait, bait over here. That's good, I suppose, maybe... Um, I will call in my allies very, very soon. I just want to see if they're going to do anything about this. Come on. Come on now. Oh! Cowboy country. Brotherhood, you ask for the war, so you get the spoils of war. There you go. Hope you have a good life. Awesome. Oh, they took a little bit more of the bait. Manpower of Port Maw is surprisingly pretty good. 
So, here on out, I'm going to do this. Keep doing this. See what happens. Oh, they're actually attacking us again. Very nice. Maybe I should add you right back. You hold. You, you don't move. You're moving some other way. You come down here. See what happens. Unpredictable attacks. Very nice. So that's as much as we can do for that. Let's get some more medical companies. And let's go ahead and call in all our allies. Cool. Let them take the bait. Let our allies win. The allies of ours are going to attack soon anyways. Uh, actually, for right now, add you two over here. That'd be better. You guys, power armor, just throw you into here. That'd be fine. For you guys, though, I want you to... S mm, I don't want to send you suiciding into the enemy, but... Just be a little bit more careful. For the power armor, we cannot... We can pierce them. With enough piercing, we can pierce the enemies. They do have some anti-air, which is kind of not good for us, but that's alright. That's okay. You might as well attack this way, send in those boys, send in these boys as well. Heaven's Gate declared war on Yakima Nations. Cool. Right now, our manpower is okay. Lose war support for stability. I don't think that's really good for us. Um, high military command, organization, and recovery rate. I'll do that probably. That sounds pretty. Oh wait, and we want to do slaying the giants and more breakthrough and soft attack. Very nice. Cool. Um, let's see. All but you guys will attack this way. Did you actually win there? You might not be able to, and that's okay. Well, regardless, everyone go right on ahead. And I should have done this a little bit before. Ooh, they actually won here. Interesting. They're still attacking us over here, which is fine. I thought I built an airbase around here. Oh, it's over here. That's alright. Cool. Some more salvaged fighters. Maybe I should have increased my uh, conscription levels. Whatever. Dive bombers. Give me 200 more of those guys. Very, very useful. Oh, salvaged fighter? Sure, why not? Throw you over here. And that will be alright. Nah, I don't need you guys right now. Production, we could probably help out with Sky Reavers. Do that. Ooh, Radar actually could help as well. We don't have a lot of Radar, but it's some. It's something. Cool. Let's go ahead and... If we can beat Port Maw, then the rest of the Brotherhood will fall. And yeah, actually, we've got New Reno and the Brotherhood doing pretty well over here. We haven't done a lot. I'm going to call my puppet in anyways. Weather Dogs has passed away, unfortunately. They're still attacking me, which is nice. They're attacking me over here as well. Very interesting that they took the bait. And they're attacking me even though I can still pierce them. Glorious. Ah, gotta love that Hoi 4 AI. Oh, yeah, just keep thinking you're going to win, guys. Oh, this is definitely going to help. Refine mixtures. Just keep doing that. Oh, we are not winning in some select locations, so go ahead and stop the attacks. Don't worry about attacking too much. Our allies are there to help attack as well. And I don't want too many casualties. Oh, but, oh my goodness, look at that. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Come on, keep attacking me, boys. I love it. Attack me harder. Cool. So, we'll probably have to specifically point out different areas where we should attack. Where I should manually command attacks, like here. Maybe we can win here, maybe we can't. We have air superiority, There, we can pierce half of the enemy divisions or so. We might win. It is a little difficult, let you guys come on back in. Coming back into the battle. Send you two now, some fresh divisions, very fresh divisions. We might not win, which will be okay, no worries. Basic drill for more defense and breakthrough. What is this? Soft attack? Nah. We could use more defense or organization. Probably more organization because I'm seeing that our guys are getting kind of tired out now down around here. Slaying the Giants. Nice. More soft attack breakthrough. And then we'll get more division organization as well as defense. Nice. I just wanted to see how our guys were doing. Cool. Yes. And uh, I did read your comments yesterday. Ooh, we were actually defeated when we came over there. But... I did see that someone says they like to watch me because they like to see me struggle. That's so cruel. That's so mean. 
I just want to play Hawaii 4 and enjoy myself. I don't want to struggle. What's a struggling is a part of life, man. We struggle every day. Sometimes you just don't want to struggle. Oh, but look at this. The Washington Brotherhood has really struggled quite a bit. And you know what? I'm just going to give this to the Brotherhood again just because I really don't care about this. Maybe next time I'll take some more territory, but whatever. But yeah. The Brotherhood has really struggled against us, which is beautiful. Uh, just get rid of that. Cool. Let these guys come back around. It looks like the Brotherhood have exhausted their stockpile of manpower, first of all, as well as probably power armor. Nice. Stim packs are very necessary for what we're doing. Um, Recon. More reconnaissance is always a good thing. Cool. Oh, but boy, is this laggy. What is going on? Is someone getting liberated? Did someone get liberated? Holy... What the heck happened? New Canaan? What? What just happened? What? What? How did they take all this? Did you convert all the Mormon people or something already? Holy crap, I've never seen this happen before. The Mormons just went crazy. Well, I guess they've always been crazy, a little crazy, but holy smokerinos. Um, for this... Do this, do this, and add you right back into the line. Hope you guys are ready to push a little bit, because that's what we're going to do. For you guys, I still have to manually control you to do this, though. Send in the infantry, not the unpower armor divisions, just because... The power armor, attacking with power armor won't really give us results that we really want. And actually, you're still over here, but you're not really part of the line. Right here, I'm going to do this. I'm going to do a pro gamer move. Put you over here because I will need you to, like, defend that tile. For here, just go ahead and try to attack. You might be able to win, you might not, but that's why I'm putting you on careful. We got quite a bit of political power. Awesome. We're out of manpower, so we're near the end of the campaign, so I don't mind going with service by requirement. We're out of things to build, which means... Build, build, and then build, build. And then... I should really build stuff in my own lands, you know? There you go. Maybe a little bit more resources. Cool. Lower that by one, lower that by one. That'd be good. One, 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 one. Awesome. Raise upgrades to medium. As we're still mobilizing more men. And look, we made an encirclement with our allies. Beautiful. Just lovely. Standing tall. Very nice. More division defense. More division organization. That's it for the focus tree. Go back to construction engineering. Alright, for you guys, go ahead and go ham. They've abandoned their line. Excuse me. And for you guys... Uh, you really can't do very well since you will be attacking into the mountains as well. I don't want to try this too hard, but I think we'll be okay. This part of the line, though, just not going to worry about it at all. You guys, thank you for playing. Um, just do this for now. And then I'll push you over this way. Alright, just go right ahead. Nice. You got some of these guys. You guys come here, help attack. And this will open up a new front into the booties. I love booty attacks. Ah, oh, beautiful. Cool. You're right here. And you'll do that. Ah, oh, glorious. Isn't it just glorious? Um, There's really not much else we can do. Let's get some mortars, I suppose. We are done with our land auction, which is kind of nice. As we're slowly pushing up. So we've done about 80% of all the work. We've lost 2,000 men. Our enemies have lost 29,000. So I'm thinking this casualty rate is pretty darn good. Very nice. Oh, look at our men just getting rid of Port Ma. Oh, go right ahead as well, boys. Oh, you don't need to be crazy. But you could probably help out here too. Oh, baby, look at those guys just melt. Beautiful. Melty babies. Ugh. Ooh, even better recon. Thank you very much. Let's get even better recon past that. Yes, we are out of manpower, which isn't always a good thing. It's probably actually a very, very bad thing. Let's do this real quick. Do that. Do this. Do that. Very nice. Give a guy a little bit more time. 
to prepare himself, get ready, get reorganized. Okay, you've had more than enough time to do so. Be a little bit balanced, get some binoculars, have some cherry pie, something like that. I don't know. And throw in another division. Oh, two divisions. Well, really, we don't need any more power armor. As much as I love power armor, mm, yeah, we don't really need it too much. Let's get rid of these guys as well. Oh, the Port Maws capitulated. Awesome. Good job, guys. You did a great, great job. Up here, because they're all kind of individually wrapped around each other, there's really no good single place for me to do this. Have everyone come up here, and then just kind of wallop them this way. And have everyone come over here and do that, and wallop them that way. And go ahead when you can. Thank you for playing, Port Ma. Your contribution to society has been not written down. We will never remember you. Cool. A little bit of manpower, very nice, very nice. Need more war support. Cool. And these guys are going to be a little bit of a bugger, we could say. But yeah, at this point, I think the Washington Brotherhood is mostly screwed. I'll uh, let you guys come up here. They don't seem to be doing very much. Get a new general, dude. Rondo Tibbet. Hello there. Uh, as soon as I hire him, he gets sick. Wow. Wow, guys. Really? Oh, very nice. Harold Haggerty? Not bad. Good stuff, I suppose. You guys over here. Uh, Graham Kieran. Ah, an infantry expert. Very nice. Oh, wow, we even took the capital for the most part. Cool, link up with those guys. Oh, we have a mortar. Very interesting. More explosive soft attack, that would be glorious. Just make your way all over here, and then... Fort Williamson. Come up that way, come up that way, come up that way. Cool, sure, whatever. Sounds nice, sounds good. Love it. Better dynamite for mortars, thank you very much. Stockpiles looking very beautiful. And we did it! Very, very nice. Um, frankly, I'm probably just going to take everything. No one deserves anything else since I've spread all the previous land all around the place. Very good. Ah, oh, I love it. Beautiful. Now that's some thick steel rangers. Oh, baby, look at that. We got a good chunk of Washington without Bellingham. Um, we got a good chunk of Oregon. But I'm really concerned about the uh, Mormon Alliance. They're very thick. But that's pretty much going to be the campaign. Wow, less than half an hour and we finished off the campaign. Not bad. Um, thoughts. This is only five days worth of campaigns, even though I made 15 thumbnails. But the Desert Rangers, even if I didn't choose a Brotherhood of Steel, it wouldn't have been extremely hard. You just needed to kind of know what you're doing with medical companies, anti-tank and piercing. If you're fighting anyone using power armor. I mean, if I went with the Nevada path, which means we create our own faction... It, I would have had to be a little bit more diplomatic with who I declare a uh, war on. If I went with the NCR, trying to fight the Brotherhood wouldn't have been super difficult as long as you can defend very well in this mod, or even Hoi 4 period. So, overall, I enjoyed it. It's a very short campaign. And tomorrow, we're going to go... I'll be honest with you. I'm going to go back and probably play the Enclave just because I said I would play as the Autocratic Enclave like three weeks ago. I said I would, and I wanted to play the Desert Rangers kind of as a break from the Enclave, but I want to be a guy, a man of my word. So I said I would do it, so I will probably do it. So with that in mind, anyways, guys, thank you very much for watching. Leave a like if you liked the video. Leave a like for the Steel or Desert Rangers. Subscribe if you're new, and I will see you tomorrow where we hopefully won't see such a huge Mormon alliance. Thanks for watching.